What's going on guys, my name is Enoch and starting this list of top 100 applications, let's check out this app called Summarify. When it comes to summarizing videos especially from YouTube, this app does it perfectly. So in this case where you watched a long video and thought you could just get key points, this application can do that easily. The app uses AI to break down long videos into concise, easy to read summaries. So just paste a YouTube link, upload a local video or grab a content from other sources and you get it summarized. Best part, you can share the summary or export it as PDF. And what makes this different is it has different video summary types so you can specifically choose the style of summary you want to get. Whether a brief summary or just bullet points, it even lets you generate quizzes from the content so you can test your understanding and it can create mind maps that break down the main points it supports multiple languages so you can get summaries in different tongues. The only downside is you can either watch an ad for a video summary or upgrade for a no ad experience. But that aside, it is a pretty cool useful application you should check out. Next is an application called My Mind. And I've tried several bookmarking applications and I've come across some really good ones. However, how this application approaches bookmarking is another level. First up, the clean and elegant UI makes storing whatever it is here very awesome. Once you share anything to the application, whether link or media, the app uses AI to provide details for what you've saved, including short descriptions, tags, and even allows you to add notes to each item you save, maybe state something to remember why you saved it. And when it comes to organization, you really wouldn't have to stress too much because the application beautifully organizes your items into cards and this layout, making it easy to find whatever you are looking for. Plus, you can use the search bar to search for specific words. And not just media or links, you can also add notes. Plus, you can create spaces like folders. A really smooth, well-designed bookmarking application infused with AI which neatly organizes all your bookmarked items. Fellow Search is another AI-powered application on the list. This app acts more than just a search engine. You can first search for anything at all. The app breaks down all the search results, considers perspectives from several sources and comes out with a conclusion, and then goes ahead to include the search sources beneath, kinda like Ask Search, and if the results from your search is exactly what you are looking for, it even allows you to create a PowerPoint presentation for the results in various themes or templates, but this is just web search alone. It allows you to search across languages, find verified information, and even get real-time data from platforms like Reddit and X, and can even pull PDFs, Word documents, and PowerPoints straight from search. And if you're always on X, you can ask fellow with a question and it will fetch answers for you. And so if you're looking for some advanced or different kind of AI browser type of application, this is definitely worth checking out. If you love movies and TV shows and always love keeping track, well, this application called Tracked should be your go-to. It keeps track of everything you watch and lets you check in to shows and movies in real time. You can see what's trending, browse anticipated releases, and even find where to stream content. It partners with Just Watch to give you streaming links for over 650 services worldwide. You can make personalized lists, track your collection, get detailed stats, set up watch reminders, and even add comments under shows or movies, plus rate them as well. There is a VIP section that unlocks even more features like advanced filtering, unlimited lists, and reward tracking. This is an ad-free application and it's actually quite popular, but if you haven't come across it yet and you are serious about your watch list, Tracked is a must-have. If you love music and want to turn your favorite lyrics into visually stunning posts on your Instagram or Facebook stories, Tune Text is the perfect application for that. It allows you to extract lyrics from songs and overlay them on stylish backgrounds with full customization options. You can tweak text styles, colors, and fonts to match your aesthetic, and beyond static lyric cards, you can add images, videos, and even audio clips of up to a minute to make your creations more dynamic. The app also has a vast song library, including trending or latest tracks, so you can search for your favorite track, copy parts of it lyrics, and easily create a card which you can save as image or directly share to social media. Plus, it offers offline access so you can work on your lyric art anytime using music from your local storage. 
OneSec is an application designed to stop you from mindlessly opening distraction applications. Every time you try to launch an app like Instagram or TikTok, you will see this slow animation which forces you to pause and take a deep breath before proceeding and also displays the number of times you have tried to open that particular application in the last 24 hours. And hereafter, you can decide whether to continue to the application or leave. This moment of reflection drastically reduces impulsive usage and studies shows it cuts social media consumption by 57% on average. It is useful for improving productivity, mental focus, and even breaking habits like doom scrolling or impulsive shopping, if that is your habit. The free version lets you control one application, but for full customization and multi-app blocking, OneSec Pro is available. And so if you struggle with digital distractions, OneSec is a must-have application. Next is an application called Next Snap. And if you are familiar with the app called TrueShot, this app serves a similar purpose. It allows you to present your screenshots or even any image in a professional way and is packed with editing tools that make this possible. And so if you took a screenshot but you just can't throw it into any chat or even post it on social media just like that, you just load it into this application, add a fitting background, add filters, text, make size adjustments and more. While built-in size presets ensures your images are optimized for different platforms like X, Instagram or any blog. The app also has a frame section which allows you to add a mobile frame to the screenshot you could actually get creative with it and once you are done, just tap the share button to save your work or share directly anywhere. Voicebox is an awesome audio recording application I recently came across and I really recommend you check it out. The app allows you to extend audio recordings so once you end the recording, you can tap the microphone icon right on it and then you can record more which will be added to the original recording. This is a pretty cool feature hardly seen in audio recording applications. Another cool feature is audio trimming, which allows you to cut out parts of your recording and also audio adjustments and here you can increase volume, change speed, add more bass and treble, preview to see how it turned out before saving, which is another awesome feature for an audio recording application. Plus you can merge two separate recordings, add favorites, all these unique features this application has makes it a really great must-have audio recording application. Not forgetting the clean and minimal UI design. With woods lights and dark themes, you can add security on top, let do not disturb be turned on automatically when recording and more. So check it out, it is a free application which has taken audio recording to another level. Next up is called Twine, an elegant and modern RSS reader that makes keeping up with news and blogs a pleasure. It supports both RSS and Atom feeds, allowing you to curate your own information sources. The interface is designed for smooth reading with a minimalist reader mode that fetches articles without distractions. Twine also includes powerful filtering tools, letting you prioritize certain topics and archive important posts for later. You can search through articles quickly and even import and export OPML lists to sync with other RSS tools. And if you want a refined, easy-to-use alternative to Google Reader or Feedly, Twine is a top contender. Plus, it is open source so all your news interests are not tracked. And then we have Text and Story, which is a fun application that lets you create animated text message conversations perfect for storytelling, content creation, and even social experiments. You can script out conversations between characters, customize message colors and profiles, and then generate a video that plays out the exchange in real time. Every keystroke, edit, and typo is recorded to make the chats feel more authentic these videos are hugely popular on platforms like TikTok, Instagram and YouTube Shorts and this application can let you create some yourself. The app also offers customization options like fonts, chat bubbles and themes to match different storytelling styles. Plus, you can create as many conversations as you want. So let's start off with this application called Hurry Day, which is a countdown application. And of course, you know what countdown apps are for, designed to track all your big moments, think holidays, birthdays, vacations or whatever. But I love the aesthetic of this one, the app's design is awesome, I mean I've seen a couple of countdown applications also with a decent modern app design, but this one stands out, it is fast, smooth, the animated GIFs also adds a fun touch, and you can also add your own images to events you add for a more personal touch, plus you can also add notes to events. Another great standout feature for me is the ability to sync the application with your calendar. 
So every activity or event added in your calendar application will also show up here on the Countdown app. Plus, you can set recurring reminders and even add its widgets to your home screen and these widgets are crazy. What really caught my attention is the ability to share countdown with friends and family. It actually takes events countdowns to a different level and makes the wait for those events feel exciting. Next is Memo Sage. This is designed to let you chat with yourself. And by chatting, I mean it looks like a messaging application, but everything here is from you and by you. And here is how useful it is. Say you've got notes scattered everywhere on different applications, random sticky notes, even scribbles on the back of receipts, this could come in handy. Think of it like WhatsApp, but for your thoughts only. You write notes the same way you send text messages, quick, natural and fluid. It doesn't bother you with complicated folder systems or anything like that. Just open the application, type and it's saved. Another quick useful feature is the search button. In the case where you have several notes yet you want to find a specific one, just type a word and the search does the work. Plus, you can create personal note spaces with custom icons for let's say work or shopping lists, personal notes or whatever. It is simple, clean and fast and works offline plus no ads. Next is called Image Splitter and this app is surprisingly handy for social media content creators or anyone who wants to add a little flair to their photo layout. In a case where you need to split an image into perfect sections for Instagram carousels or a creative project, you can make good use of this application since it does the job so well. You can decide the aspect ratio, how many vertical splits and even how many divisions on the side. Just load your image, adjust a few sliders and you are done. And what I really love is their precision. You control exactly how the image is sliced, which means no awkward crops or misaligned edges. It is one of those applications you don't realize you need until you actually use it. Next is Time Rise, which serves as a digital hourglass. You set a timer, flip your phone upside down and the screen fills up like sand flowing in an hourglass. It is such a simple concept, but incredibly satisfying to watch. You can pause the timer by flipping the device on the side or restart it by flipping it back over. And all these are just the default gesture or trigger settings. And what makes this application stand out isn't just the visual appeal, it's how it changes your perception of time. Seeing the screen fill up with color adds a physical element to a digital timer. Plus, it's customizable with different colors, notification settings, and trigger options. Great for productivity, meditation, cooking or whatever you need a timer for. It is minimal, functional and just feels good to use, makes you want to come back to it every time. This app called Get Current Wallpaper is a lifesaver. If you've ever had that moment where you set the perfect wallpaper only to lose it after switching to another one and you cannot find the original image anywhere, that is where this application comes in. It grabs and saves your current wallpaper with just a tap even if it's on the lock screen. So yes, you can save a lock screen or home screen wallpaper onto your phone. It's super straightforward, hit retrieve now and the image is saved in its original resolution. Listen, also if you use a paid wallpaper application which only lets you set wallpaper but not download unless you pay for premium, you can save the wallpaper using this Get Current Wallpaper application and don't tell the developers I told you this. And the only downside is it doesn't get frequent updates but it still functions as it's supposed to. Again, one of those applications you didn't know you needed until you really needed it. If you really need a reliable personal management application, check out Expand. You know how personal finance applications are either too complicated or just too basic to be useful? Expand has a little bit of both and it's perfect. It's an all-in-one expense tracker and budget planner that makes managing money super easy. You can quickly log your income, expenses and transfers in seconds. And it's completely offline, so no cloud syncing, but it supports backup of your data to your phone in case you switch devices or you just need to import your data. Plus, the detailed reports actually make sense. You can see a full breakdown of your account over certain periods. And I also love the fact that you can disable visibility of your account using this icon. Plus, the entire UI is awesome. I really recommend you check it out. And it's got tons of useful settings. If you are always on the digital front, glued to your screens all day, 202020 Eyebreaker Reminder must be a must-have application. And since we all know digital eye strain is real, if you've ever felt your eyes burning, getting blurry vision or headaches after a long session on the screens, this is why. 
The app is built around the 2020-20 rule. Every 20 minutes, look at something 20 feet away for 20 seconds. It sounds simple, but you wouldn't usually remember this. This is why you need this application. So you set it up once, it will remind you exactly when you need to break. You can even set your own ringtone to make sure you don't ignore it. And if 20 minutes is lengthy, you can select a different duration for both work and rest to be notified. And speaking of making life easier, let's talk about Voicer. We know AI-generated voices have come a long way and this application is proof of that. Whether you need a natural sounding AI voiceover for videos, podcasts or presentations, Voicer handles it like a pro. The text-to-speech engine is crisp, natural and dare I say, human-like. You can convert text into high-quality voiceovers in seconds and if you are a content creator, this means no more awkward robotic voices, just seamless professional sounding narrations with actually zero effort. So you just input your text, choose your AI voice and you are good to go. So whether you're making YouTube videos, audiobooks, or even just need an AI voice for accessibility purposes, you can try this application. It actually understands context so it doesn't sound like a robot reading straight from a script. And it's a free application so be sure to check it out. Next is LumiGuard which enables comfortable screen usage at night and we've all been there scrolling late at night only to get blasted by eye searing blue light. LumiGuard fixes that with advanced filtering that goes beyond basic night mode which is on almost every smartphone. With this application, you get fully customizable filters, adjustable color temperatures and even choose which applications it should be applied to. So whether you want your browser warm toned but your ebook reader even dimmer, you can do all that in the pre app settings. There is also an automatic scheduler and ambient light adjustment meaning your screen adapts to your surroundings in real time. I love this next application because of its beautiful, simple and clean UI which matches its functionality. It is called Slow Brown Noise and for anyone who struggles to focus, sleep or just need some mental clarity, Slow is the application you didn't know you needed. It's a noise generator but not just any noise generator, it's one of the best out there. You get white noise, brown noise, rain, deep ocean waves, it's got a lot. And even though some are for pro users, you still get a lot on the standard version. And the best part is not just random loops of static noise, it's actually in long durations and the sounds are high quality, dynamic and actually help drown out distractions. You can set a fade out time in case you need it to help you sleep and yes, it's a free application with no ads. Guys, consider subscribing to the channel if you enjoyed the video and if you found any application you like, let me know down in the comment section. And as always, thank you for watching. Thank you.